Hola, Carlitos Shaves is back. Video number number 16. I mean, shave video number 16th. Thank you for being here with me. So today, without further ado, we'll, I'm going to be doing a curveball. I planned this morning the shave to be an old Canadian shave. But I uh, saw a video from Mel, Melly Mel Shaves and the Rich Man Group. And he proposed a theme for the week, which is one, two, and three. Composes, com is composed of one soap. And I chose purely skin full soaps from Canada. Great, great soap. I don't know if you can see it very well. This is the connoisseur, connoisseur and it's based on deer tallow. And it's, it's amazing. I'm being dying to use it. So the only, this is a small shop, a small artisan in, the, in Canada. Her name is Linda. Linda James, James. And uh, you should try the, <clears throat> the notes. I'm gonna put in the description, I'm gonna put all the ingredients and stuff so you can track. But the notes that are listed in the, in the label are cigar parlor notes of chocolate scented tobacco with undertones of whiskey, rum, and tonka bean. And right after the bat, you can smell the chocolate, you can smell the tobacco and, and the booziness. Uh, man, to die for, I'm telling you, this is no joke. I'm gonna go with the, uh, the aftershave balm, which is amazing. All, all the ingredients which I'm gonna be listing in the description, it's just nourishing a skin food, basically. And I'm gonna be using, so, I have mentioned the one, didn't say anything about a splash, but then two is gonna be two brushes. Because the, the small opening of the, uh, of the container on the soap, I'm gonna be using this, one of the smallest brushes that I have, this is a Moog 610. This is a Portuguese brush, but this one, it's a Canadian brush that I bought in my last trip to Canada with my, my, with my daughter. It's a school trip. I bought it in a Canadian antique store in Quebec. I don't know the, I don't know the name of it, but I, I, I was looking for stuff and this is the only shaving item that I was interested. So I bought it. It was like five Canadian dollars. It was just a cheapie. But it's a good, it's a badger. I, I, saw, I saw it more as a traveling brush. So that's my Canadian, you know, Canadian item as far as the, the two. Um, and three razors. I, I went to the, in the Canadian team. So Rockwell, 6S, paired with Rockwell blades. If you can see them. Rockwell blades. First of the three, Razor Rock Game Changer 84. This is made by Joe Shop, I believe it's in Canada also. And another Razor Rock, which is gonna be the Mamba 70. And 70 is the gap between the blade and the bar. Of the, I mean the exposure of the blade outside. So. And Crown Royal Reserve that I also bought in my last trip to Canada. So, cheers. That's the only uh, Canadian stuff. I'm sweating, guys. And to for forgive me, I took a, a hot shower. I've been doing a lot. This is, as of right now, it's like 4.30 or 4.40, I mean, 4.40 in the afternoon here in Puerto Rico. I just got off work. Took a hot shower, been doing a lot of stuff. But uh, yeah, music playing in the background, just to piece me a little bit, a little bit. It's Puerto Rican folklore, New Trova, which is like new folklore. It's the son of a late um, Puerto Rican, not Puerto Rican, half Italian, adopted by Puerto Rico called Tony Croato, his son Hermes Croato, and I love his music. So it invigorates me and uh, helps me through the day. 
this for me is just therapy so I'm gonna pause it real quick because I'm gonna put some uh, some pre-shave those to the the treatment of the uh, hot towel which I have here is, is dry and uh, be right back to rock and roll and do this shave and uh, start this thing okay so give me a couple of seconds okay seconds a uh, minute so I'll see you later okay let's do this right now so as you can imagine I'm, I'm using the, the cream oil soon as I finish I'm gonna start using other stuff believe me probably it's gonna be the pre-shave of Peter uh, pre-shave serum or I'm gonna do the I'm gonna crack open the cube that I have the PAA cube so okay let's do this I've just already put my uh, the cream oil shave cream I'm gonna be using the first the Samog nah I'm gonna use the small little Canadian brushy there you go so distilled water in that Shulton cup Old Spice guess where I bought it Canada in that antique shop forgot to mention it and it's four o'clock rough day so I'm gonna I'm gonna do a face lather man I wish you can smell this I wish it just explodes since the water is hot it's a hard soap let me tell you you don't you cannot fall asleep on this artisans small artisans they they're not getting the love they deserve Linda if you're listening I'm gonna I'm gonna send you a, a message just to let you know that I that I freaking like your products I use the connoisseur I mean the the high roller which is here the other day which is beef tallow so and it's and it's amazing they source all their all the, the the tallow from hunters you know humane you know humane hunters you know what should they call it they call it ethical ethical hunters so there yeah, I think it's already good because it's a pasty consistency what you're looking for and what you do is that you paint your face paint your face and then you splay the little brushy this new this knots you know the 24s and the 28 30 there's no way you can load from there this is gonna be like awkward so this small thing works wonder display a little bit it's quite thirsty but for this is deer tallow what I'm using Very slick, very slick stuff, guys. I'm telling you. I don't know if I just jumped. I don't know if it's in the lens of the camera, but if not, bear with me, guys. Scent strength of this uh, amazing soap. It's like a ten, um, a ten. Come on, Carlos. It's like a seven, seven, eight-ish. Now you can you can feel changing as as it becomes boozy. It becomes like rumish. If you like rum, or if you are having experienced rum, when you like pour the rum and. Uh, and 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 it, you know the mixture of uh, like alcohol vapors and stuff and the and, and the aging and the wood and stuff you can feel it you can smell it man yes then then I'm gonna start off because it's gonna be from aggressive to mildish I'm gonna start with the game changer let's do this guys so I, I want to give a shout out to Scott the peaceful shaver read on Facebook that he was just reaching the 1,000 subscribers but as of this video I think he reached the uh, his goal and he's doing a giveaway I'm gonna put his link 
in the description so you can check out the giveaway tremendous generous giveaway so you should check you should check him out real uh real straight up dude member of the community the community the rich man group for quite a while so i'm mowing two days of growth just going down easy I don't use those um, this this um, Rockwell blade so very often so but they're pretty comfortable blades Swedish steel come with a sampler pack the purchase of, of the razors when I bought my 6s so I finished with one so I'm gonna put it in the bullpen so you're you're benched So when I bought my 6S through the Rockwell website, I think because of the subscription or something, they gave me free blades. I guess they gave me a hundred, hundred blades. So I have plenty of blades there. Just as soaps, I have blades for like an eternity. So it's crazy stuff. Yeah, so, so it's time for the Samog 610. I don't know how long this video will be, but blame Mel, Melly Mel, and whomever from the Rich Man Group decides to do this. You know one thing I'm gonna do before I uh, put some love in my face? This is not just lathering, it's putting love on your face. This is love, this is, this is soap love. I need to... Hmm. smell this no joke okay this is like a $17 brush small one compact We just went all over the place me talking and but this is a $17 brush a bargain and I love it I have used brushes that are like $140 $150 that have been loaned to me This one feels better than those ones. It's just me. I'm just, you know, maybe I haven't tried the, the, the correct brush. So I'm going to be going with the Mamba. Mamba 70. But you know what I did? <laughs> Frago blooper. My first pass was with the Mamba. I was like, man, I don't, I didn't. So I'm going to do the game changer now. 84. So the Race of Rock Game Changer 84 is gonna go sideways. And the rock wall is gonna go against the grain, so.
Man, whoo, it is hot. Residual slickness is on par, it's amazing. Great stuff. It's no, no, no joke. So did I tell you that I'm practicing because I'm getting some stuff in. I'm getting my straights, my straight racers. I'm gonna give a huge thanks to Marion who's hooking me up, Anthony Esposito, hooking me up with straight, and I bought two more. So I'm, I'm very, very excited and I'm practicing. I have a Chavette that I use a cartridge, I mean, um, Injector blades, a cartridge. Who uses cartridge in a straight racer? Crown Royal is kicking in. So yeah, and I'm practicing and uh, I'm gonna debut right here. I'm gonna be a witness of the tragedy or just a, a pretty exciting and uh, successful video and shave. Trying to speed up the process. It was like a 10 second load and this is a hard so and look at that. I kid you not. DK, I'm gonna send that soap to you so you can test it, okay? And let me know. So I'm gonna be uh, sending you a DM. You can send me your address. So we're in the, in the pass around group. So. Uh. Oh man. And also Marion. I'm, I'm waiting for the bear tallow, barbaric soap from them. And I bought another another dear tallow soap. And you feel so much protection. Linda, you did an amazing job. So I was also very excited because I, I spoke over Instagram with um, HAC, uh, one of the owners, it's a married couple of Cuban descent. Forgot your name, but I'm gonna I'm gonna list your name and I'm gonna link your site also. HSS Highland Highland Springs Soap Company. Great people, great conversation, man. I'm telling you, don't sleep on those small artisans in Canada and whatever. Whatever. It's just amazing stuff. Stuff made with love. So the Rockwell is being used right now. The success. Go to razor. So I'm waiting for my carved razor that uh, still somewhere. Somewhere in a mail depot. So uh, anxious to try that, that razor, the carve. Everybody talks a lot about a lot about that razor. Hey Mel, it's working out, man. Kind of an overkill. Using three, three different razors every day. So I'm using the this Rockwell on plate number two, which is very mild but efficient. Usually use number four if I'm like in after two days of growth. I don't have a lot of facial hair in some areas on my face, but where it grows in the mustache and here, it's very coarse and, and you could 
if I don't use any pre-shave or a hot towel, you could hear the feedback, the audio feedback of the razors. Like you, like you don't, you don't imagine. Okay, so. Man. Just great. Let me add a little bit here. Great. I'm gonna just go straight to uh, aftershave. Just clean up a little bit. Usually do this off camera just to get all the soap out of my ears and everything. But since we're family, I'm gonna just do it right now. Woo! Yay! All the steam from my hot shower is just inundating this, man. What is the gym? Woo! It's like two ounces in this bomb, but you just need a little bit. Just like that. A little goes a long way. You just, whoa. <sighs> Chocolate, bourbon, tobacco. Oh man, it's kind of a little bit gourmandish, but I, I said, as you put some friction, it becomes boozy. <laughs> Excellent job, Linda. Woo! It's going to my hair. And it's lotion for my arms. Everywhere. Ah. Ah. Love booziness. And Versace the Dreamer. It's that tobacco y scent. Pairs real nice to this. Look at the dent it has. Reorder time. So gonna toast. I just reached my 150 subscribers and I thank you. Cheers. I also wanna congratulate Rasa on his uh, subs. Also congratulate Scott, which I already did. Good luck, buddy. You're doing an excellent job and you're starting a soap company. Congratulations. And I'm gonna be a customer, okay? So I'm gonna, I wanna give a couple of shout outs and uh, tell everybody to do this. Gordon Christie, uh, Soul Call Shaves, Manny, seen your videos, I, see, I saw your shave then. You got a lot of stuff, man, I was so impressed, man. Woof. Anthony Vincent, haven't seen you um, in a couple of days, so I hope everything is working out for you, man, from the heart. Um, so Sharp David, Barbecue, Savage, just got your, um, your, your, your smoker, your pellet smoker, and you're just killing it, man. Whoa, if I'm in the LA area, I'm gonna visit you or, you know. So, pick up the phone. Ah, so also videos from Ken Surfs, um, DK, DK, Roland, DK. Love your stuff, man. Your brush collection and your beer selection, man, I'm so envious, man. I wish I live over there, man, and have all the selections of beers that you have, man. This is crazy. John Patton. I'm gonna be using the Pauly Tim uh, soap, which I'm here, it's here, it's close to the bullpen. I go like that, and it's going to the bullpen. Here it is, man. Great guy. I'm gonna li leave a link right there to his website. Uh -huh. And uh, man, a couple of people, Marion the Barbarian. Marion, man, such a stand-up dude. Go ahead and check out his content on his channel. Subscribe. Great dude, great dude. I'm so glad I met him. Add him through the social media, but you know, I know that uh, we're gonna see each other in the near future. Melly Mel shaves, and uh, man, I think I'm done for now. Oh, of course, Dave Card. Dave, I'm a fan. I'm watching your, your technique, Dave. Great uh, outdoor uh, shave you did. You need some glasses, man. You need some shades. So step up a little bit your coolness level, and then you'll be a solid rock star. You're already dangerous with that straight razor, man. So anyway, I will just respect you for just the way it is. But with shades, it'll be unstoppable, man. Oof. So yeah, I'm done. So 
subscribe to my channel if you like what you see. I'm gonna be tearing down this medicine cabinet, so probably I need to be more, a little bit more creative for my shape video, or if not, it's gonna be in a couple of days. So uh, I'll be back. I'll be practicing my straight racer game, so uh, it's gonna be a great one. So Carlito Shapes is out of the house. See you on the next one, which is gonna be 17th. I got a surprise for you for that one. Bye-bye.